46 computer kitchen here. Yeah. So we can uh, you can say that it's a full classroom. So 46 students can learn here. We will have two instructors here. They will be teaching the computer to the student. And because it's a mobile, we can take it anywhere you want because it's powered by the solar panels and it's got a mobile Wi-Fi. So we can take it anywhere. So we're going to start with uh, Makokoba in my constituency, the Bulawaya South actually I can say. We're going to start with it. So we're going to have a program every day for two hours, two hours lessons. So then we go forward every week. The next following week we've got another program. And that's how it's going to carry on. And we're going to rotate all the area, you know, it's going to be station on the Because it's a mobile, we can take it anywhere we want. And I'm going to request the government also. Because this, this model is very good for the rural area. But today, the, you know, your world is going with the technology. So we cannot remain behind our children. So I want to start from the grassroots people to learn, you know, the, our children to learn the computer. Once they know the basic computer, then I have an uh, innovation hub also. That is like, I can say, the advanced program they can learn. So if they're happy with this and they have more interest, so that we can put them into the, the innovation hub. Then they can learn the graphic design, uh, making the website. Oh, there are so many programs we have that they can learn from there and earn some money. So we want to equip with the skill to our youth. So this is my whole idea. So we keep them away from the drug abuse and all these other funny things. So I'm going to have no, I, I'm, I'm not going to have that okay, but I'm, I'm going to teach even the older people also. Because a lot of our old folks, they don't know about the computer. So I want to learn also for them, also they can like, equip themselves, you know, with the computer knowledge. So it will be good for them to understand. Because our world is going that way. In another five years, we don't know where we are going to be. So if you don't know the technology, we'll remain behind. So we want to do that rather than we can remain with the rest of the world. Right, and then if you can, how much, how much have you, how much did you take to this particular project? Uh, this one cost me 120,000 dollars, including the bus. And uh, I'm not going to charge anything to our people, it's free of charge. And it's not, this bus is not going to be only for the election only, no. It's going to be driven like this all the time for the community. So, more and more people can benefit. That is my aim. That's how I want to uh, give more and more our youth the knowledge of the computer so they can uh, equip themselves with other skills. Right, and I think that's a big question. Should we be expecting another bus like this? Uh, no. <laughs>